Hey, welcome to Graphic Policy Television, GPTV. I'm Brad, and my hands is Hungry Ghost by Victoria Ying. Uh, so it's interesting. This is a wonderful, wonderful graphic novel. I want to first start off as Ying is, is a name I don't know, but I know a lot of her work and love a lot of her work. Um, so some of the, the film credits include Wreck-It Ralph, Big Hero 6, and Paper Man, three of my favorite animated films. And then uh, she also illustrated Diana, Princess of the Amazons. And if you never read that, um, it's it's really really good. Uh, great story, fantastic art. I actually love the art. I mean, it's it's adorable. Um, so this story isn't as adorable. Uh, it is a story about a girl named Valerie who has an eating disorder um, due to the pressures of her mom. Um, she's Taiwanese. Her mother is very obsessed with looks uh, and staying thin and doesn't understand, you know how anyone would find her attractive if she wasn't, and how she needs to watch what she eats, and all this stuff, which leads to Valerie having a, an eating disorder. I'm not going to even attempt to name the, the eating disorder, because I'm not, I always get that stuff wrong. Um, and it's not really the point, is the specifics as to the name of it, it's what she's doing. Uh, and she feels the pressure. I mean, it's, it's, it is a tough graphic novel to read, um, while it is not, um, you know, biographical about Victoria's experiences, it is based off of her experiences. There's a, there's a, uh, a follow-up and then the end about that a little bit. And really it comes down to it. It's a, it's a lot of, like, cultural pressure, just pressure from her mother. Um, and and it's, it's an interesting read to see Valerie kind of grow and, and deal with this and, and eventually break. Um, and it's, you know, it's a tough one. I, I think that's, it's interesting, you know, even if, if you don't experience this yourself, that you, there's still a lot to, to connect with the, the idea of the, the pressures that we receive from others, especially our parents. Um, I'm not going to go into the full story on, on the relationships and everything, uh, cause there are some twists and turns I, I don't want to, I don't, don't want to spoil and talk about. Um, but you know, it's, it, it's things you can still relate to even if you yourself have not had an eating disorder. And I think in, in a good way, it's, it's, it's good to read about, like, it's a good read about that. Like there, there's a lot of, you know, it, it'll get you to think about your own relationships and it's, that's not a bad thing. Um, but it's, it's a tough read. I mean, obviously it's a very, it's going to be a very difficult subject for some to read. Um, you know, I, I felt my heart tugging so over and just kind of in my head of like, please don't, please don't, please don't. Um, there's moments towards the end that I was, you know, choking up. Um, it's, 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 it's tough. Like it's completely tough. Like it's not a, it's not an easy, it's not an easy read. Um, it's really well done, though. It is so good, so excellent, so fantastic. Um, highly, highly recommend it. And, you know, I just, I, I think it's wonderful. Um, you know, it's, it's really, really well done. And, you know, there are, there are some, um, books at the end, some resources that are recommended for those who, um, you know, are going through a health, this health crisis and need help. Um, and you know, I, I, I know nothing of that. So I like, I can't really talk about it, but it's, it's well done. And, and, and as a whole, like, you know, if it helps somebody absolutely fantastic. Um, you know, I, I don't, I can't sit there and say, Oh, you should, you should give this to someone who has a eating disorder. Like, no, like that's not a, I'm not recommending it. I'm not talking about, it, but like there's, there's just something Really, it's really good about it. Someone who does not experience that is not, you know, dealt with that specifically. Um, you know, it's it's a good read. Like I, I, I have empathy. Like I, I it hit the heartstrings and and tugged and like, you know, it, it's. I think it does some really interesting stuff to to show the pressure of it all uh, that can lead to this. Uh, the art is is amazing. Um, I I love 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 the art. Um, it's a, it's a style I think is absolutely great. It's a style that reminds me a lot of Paper Man, which is really funny because that's what I was immediately thinking of when I was reading it and then she worked on it. So yeah, there you go. Um, but overall, uh, this is, it's fantastic. It's, I figured it was going to be a tough read and it's a tough read. Um, but 
highly recommend it. Well done. Um, fantastic. So it's, it's a great kind of mix of graphic memoir and graphic medicine put together. Um, just uh, good. It's really, really good. Uh, you can go get this. It is out in shops now. You can go get it. And uh, we got a link beneath this video. We're putting your zip code at Talva Comic Shops near you. No shop, no problem. We do have some links where you can purchase your own. There'll be affiliate links, so we get a small percentage. By doing that, you help support your support our site. I uh, appreciate it. And speaking of support, I want to thank for a second for us up with the review copy. And, of course, thank you all for watching. Uh, if you are into graphic novels or into comics, check us out over at graphicpolicy.com. We're on Twitter, Facebook, YouTube, Tumblr, Instagram, TikTok, Mastodon, all at Graphic Policy, keeping it nice and consistent. Until next time, keep reading those comics and keep it geeky. Hey, thanks for watching the previous video from Graphic Policy Television. Just by watching, you help support our site. Thank you so much. Now, if you're watching these videos, you probably care about geeky things like movies, television, comic books, toys, games, video games, you name it. You can go and subscribe right now to our YouTube channel to stay in touch and catch all the new videos, or check out our website at graphicpolicy.com. There's a nice link on this end of the video. But as always, thank you for watching. Keep on rocking and keep it geeky.